Mom? Uh, Mom, are you a uh, drinking again? Don't be silly, dear. Booze is illegal, you know. Yeah, Mom. It's just that Dad mentioned. Your father. Why, I just can't get away from his prying eyes. Always spying, always watching. You, you mind your own business, George. Now, Lorraine, this is for your own good. I know you're keeping a secret from me. It's mine to keep. <laughs> Dad, Mom, knock it off, you two. Now, you listen here, young man. This is an adult matter between your mother and me. Dad, I know, but your way isn't working. You gotta give her some space here. Huh? Where'd she go? Mom? Aha! Uh -huh. I knew it! What is that in your hand? Rum? Gin? A wine cooler? For your information, it's brass cleaner. I have a job to do here, you know. Lorraine? No! Lorraine, I'm just trying to look out for you. You know the kind of trouble we can get into if you're drinking again. George, I wouldn't be so on edge if you weren't suffocating me all the time. Was that an admission? An admission of how smothered I am by you? Giving this to any person would be an act of cruelty. Mom? So, what's up with Dad? Ugh, indeed. What is up with him? That setup in his garage is pretty intense. That's not the word I'd use. More like creepy. I heard that! I don't want to annoy whoever's on the other end of that thing. Mom? Mom, look, I'm on your side. If you got a problem, I want to help. But this is a choice you got to make yourself. Oh, look at you. You're such a sweet boy. I'm so glad you take after me rather than your father. What, Lorraine? What? Ugh! I can't live like this! Dad, you're not helping. Oh, but I disagree, Martin. It's important that I catch her in the act so I can get it on tape. Once it's on tape, I can show her that she has a problem. That's ridiculous, Dad. You're acting like this is some kind of sting operation. Huh? Where'd she go? Mom? Aha! Uh -huh. I knew it! There! What did you just hide? That was some sort of fruity liqueur! It's a spray bottle of simple orange for the cleaning I'm trying to do! Lorraine, I'm sorry. It's just that you're acting so cagey lately. Cagey? Maybe I'm acting like I don't want to be spied on all the time. It's not all the time, Lorraine. I do sleep occasionally, you know. Mom? Mom, please! Yeah, Lorraine, listen to us! Oh! Damn it, Dad! What? Cut out! Mom? Mom? Huh? Where'd she go? Mom? Aha! Uh -huh. I knew it! Hey, is that... No! Lorraine, don't ignore me! Lorraine! Ah, what happened? What the heck am I looking at? Yes! Mom, now the dad isn't watching. Oh, Martin! 
Uh, <clears throat> Was that a flask, Mom? Flask? <laughs> Don't be ridiculous. I, I... Look, it's okay, Mom. Get a hold of yourself. Oh, your father's right. I'm backsliding. But it's been so hard, what with your brother and sister leaving, and then your father getting obsessed with his monitors and... Oh. <laughs> Let me take care of the flask. Dad doesn't have to know anything about it. <laughs> oh, thank you, sweetheart. I couldn't bear the thought of facing your father over this. This timeline sucks. Mom and Dad are fighting again, Mom's drinking. It's like everything Doc and I ever did to fix things is falling apart. Time to get some attention. My mom's flask. It feels a little low. I could get in a lot of trouble if I were caught with this. There's gotta be a better person to show this to. Mom? There's got to be a better person to show this to. Now that I have the booze, I just got to get caught with it. Hands up, citizen. Assume the position. Here goes nothing. There better be apple juice in this. Uh, why don't you open it and find out? Don't get smart with me! Uh, I knew you were no good, McFly. Officer Parker, what seems to be the problem here? Citizen McFly, ma'am. Came strolling up with a 181B violation in his pocket. Ugh. You, young citizen, where did you get that? That booze? Nowhere? Is he being smart with me? Yeah, he played that attitude on me as well. Could we just fast forward the lecture and just get this over with already? No! Officer, demerit him severely. And as for the alcohol, drop it into the decycling bin. With pleasure, ma'am. Now, keep your nose clean, or you'll find yourself in front of Citizen Brown. This is for possession of an illegal and socially corrosive substance. Some might argue that description. It's got my name on it. They couldn't do anything with this. What did I tell you? I wasn't doing anything. That's exactly why I gave you a demerit. Now scram!
Now we're in business. I outsmarted you, didn't I? Ah, oh, don't be like that, Einie. Einstein, is that your name in this timeline too? Huh, guess not. Look, Einie, I've got a treat for you. Atta boy, now hold still. See, I'm not such a bad guy, right? <gasps> whoa, whoa, okay. I guess I've won you over. I wish they were all this easy. Huh? Well, what is it, boy? Play dead! Uh, Officer Parker, subdue that beast at once! Einstein, sit! Einstein? Oh, if he bites me, you'll be in a world of trouble, citizen! Wait, I know that creature. Officer Parker, that's the stray that keeps escaping the kennel. I thought he was muzzled. I took the muzzle off. You what? That's right, he's my dog now. Citizen, you are in violation of Statute 357K. Parker, demerit this hooligan at once. I'll return this creature to the kennel. Yes, ma'am. Filthy, wretched beasts. Don't worry, Einy. Once I fix all this, you'll be back with Doc and romping through time. Now stay out of trouble, unless you want a visit from Citizen Brown. This one's for harboring or owning a vicious dog. Huh? Einstein's just misunderstood. A stranger in a strange land. Like me. Give me a can of spray paint. I got an urge to paint something. Happy little trees? Get yourself a watercolor kit. I'm not sharing my wall. Yeah? You and Leech, Jennifer? Hey, don't badmouth Leech. There's a lot more to him than soup, you know. Like what? For one thing, he wields an axe like nobody's business. 